Sagittarius. It is your girl, Spiritual Sag. So let me tell y'all the song that I was getting right before I hit the record, but it said, why didn't I say the things I needed to say? How could I let my angel get away? Now my world is tumbling down. I can see it so clearly, but you're nowhere around. So let's see, Spirit. What messages do you have for my Sagittarius collector? You have Sagittarius anyway. Your chart, sun, moon, rising, Venus, north, no, it's out, no, anywhere, child. Let's see, Spirit. What are the messages for my Sagittarius? Okay, so, wow, grief. There you are, Sag. Have man, have horse on their ass. Someone, okay, so either Sag, you could be in grief about someone or someone could be in grief about you. They see it so clearly. And this card says refocus. Excuse me, so I feel like somebody has started to refocus on the Sagittarius here. We have barrier coming up in the reverse. We also have forgiveness here. Like, this person admires you. And, you know, they could want to take action. They see you as their divine feminine, okay? But this person is having some type of self-worth issues right now. Hold on, you guys. Let me turn the light on. Okay. So, they see you as their divine feminine. They're focused on you, just period, okay? With this admire, this person sees a lot of light around you, just like they do in this divine feminine card right here. And like I said, this person wants forgiveness. And whatever barrier was up between the two of you, they want that to come down. So it's coming in the reverse. Somebody wants forgiveness. They want to take action here. But like I said, self-work. Okay? So I think, who sings that song? I think it's uh, Babyface. Yeah. Now my world is tumbling down. I can see it so clearly, but you're nowhere around. The nights are lonely, the days are so sad, and I just keep thinking about the love that we had. I'm missing you, and nobody knows it but me. All right. <clears throat> How could I let my engine get away? Yeah. So with the Knight of Cups coming up in the reverse, mm, maybe they didn't see it before. What did they say? I can see it so clearly, but you're gone now. Could be a lot of distance between the two of you. There's a damn brick wall with a steel door or something like that. But they want that to come down. Yep, look at that. Five of Pentacles. Person is out of the car. It's like, this is someone, they've lost all contact with you. Okay, so this is not somebody that you broke up with yesterday and they know your phone number. No, this person has lost all, either they changed their number, lost their contacts, or you changed your number. 814, somebody need to look up 814, okay? Um, something's going to happen on a Tuesday or something happened on a Tuesday. Okay, I'm getting the 15th as well. So let's see, Spirit. I can see it so clear. You know where I'm around. All right, so some of you guys could be doing with a cancer. We have the chariot here. Oh man, like all this person does. Look at this. If y'all have this deck at home, look at this person's eyes. Like all this person does is drive around, listen to music, and they hope to. Wow. Okay. Somebody could be dealing with a Taurus. Spirit's telling me to grab the hidden truth oracles. So, this is someone who hopes to see you when they are out riding around. Uh, someone could have had a, a blue car, red car, black car, or a white car. This person hopes to see your car when they out. Like, somebody's really going through it, y'all. This is crazy. Okay? I'm so fucking for real. This person could be drinking, but I, I just feel like they're not sleeping. They just drive. They don't want to be around anybody. They just get in their car and they drive and they listen to music and they look for your car. Okay, so we have, I hid behind the material things. Mm. Okay, what else, Spirit? I couldn't let you get close to me. Well, why is that? We're going to clarify it. I'm pulling some more of these right quick. Spirit, what else is coming out of this deck? 
for my Sagittarius Collective. All right. I am grateful for the spiritual lesson and just being near you is intoxicating. At the bottom of the deck, I'm starting to understand the connection now. What did it say? I can see it so clearly now, but you're gone. Okay. Wow. I hid behind the material. So this could have been a person who wanted to bury themselves in work or wanted to date people with the material. Yep, look at that. Hid behind the material. King of Pentacles. Capricorn to us Virgo. But they see you as their divine feminine. Like this person is definitely watching you on something, okay? Four cups. Yes. Wow. This person's going through it. They miss you. That's what I'm getting with this four cups and nine of wands. And look on that nine of wands, how they looking out for you. Poor thing. You know, sometimes that shit happen. I talked about this in my live. <coughs> talked about this in my live the other night. I said, what the most high God has for you is for you. I said, but when you out there chasing other shit, you won't see it. Sometimes it'll be right there in your face and you don't see it. Okay, so this person hiding behind the material, I feel like he was right there in the face and they didn't see it. Okay, what's this? Four of Wands, yep, there's your Emperor. It's so clear, divine feminine, divine masculine. Okay, somebody could be doing one of the Aquarius with the star card. Look at that, Two of Cups. This person wants to heal this connection, but I'm just getting the energy of somebody don't even know where to start. So that's why they're driving around looking. They see a car that look like you. This person could even be, wow. They could be going to last known addresses. Damn, bro. All right, see, what is this one? Tomorrow morning, I'm gonna hit the dusty road. I'm gonna find you wherever. Ever you might go okay and i'm gonna unload my heart and hope that you come back to me so this is someone who like i said they be driving around looking for your ass it's like this person like, i can't sit here and i do nothing and they tell how long they've been sitting in this grief they're gonna ask you for your forgiveness unload their heart tell you how they feel and you know hope that you come back to them so some of you guys could be dealing with a pisces or a leo but what i'm getting is you know, that whole energy of nobody knows it but me. So this person's like suffering in silence with the moon and the strength card. Mm. Some of y'all could be doing with Scorpio. I'm getting this connection completely came to an end. Like, eh, it's done. Could have been a, a while since you talked to this person. And like I said, numbers have changed. People lose. Now, this is what I'm seeing. A, 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 a cell phone. This moon. If you ever shattered your screen on your phone, that's what this look like. So, here yeah, they might have the same phone, same number. But they can't see none of their contacts. Screen blacked out. The screen is blacked out and it's shattered. Okay, so what else, here? <clears throat> Three of Wands and Magician. That's that. Tomorrow morning, I'm going to hit the dusty road. This person going to find your ass. This, with showing up with the Magician, the Magician has everything they need to manifest what it is that they want. Okay, so this emperor is going to be fucking determined to find you. They don't, I don't know how the hell they're going to do it, but they're going to do it, child. They want to fight for it. They're going to, like I said, they're going to tell you how they feel and hope that you'll forgive them. Mm. I feel bad for this person, but I mean, like, I don't know what happened, you know. They just feel so alone and out in the cold. And like I said, they don't want to be bothered with nobody because they're miserable, y'all. It's only one person that can bring life back into them, and that's the Sagittarius. And for some of you guys, this could be vice versa, so take it where it resonates. 
people be asking this person, hey man, what's wrong with you? Oh no, nah, man, I just had a hard day at work. Okay, ooh, Queen of Swords. Somebody was wasting time with a Queen of Swords, Seven of Pentacles. Okay, that was wasting time with a Queen of Swords. Um, could have been a third party situation or this could have been with some, they could have been like married before and never got over this energy. Somebody could have been stuck on the past. Oh, I'm just getting, it's like somebody's really fucking nosy and always involves themselves in shit. It's like they kept up so much drama that this person, like, they just missed what the fuck was in front of them. Whoever that Queen of Swords is, could be man, woman, mama, daddy, brother, sister, I don't know. But it took up a lot of this person's time. Okay, what else? Weird? Could also have been an ex spouse. All right, so now you have the hyphen. Yep, Taurus. Could have been an ex spouse who's angry. You got the Ace of Cups with the Ace of Swords. Yeah. It's like anytime this masculine gets ready to have a new beginning with someone, this Queen of Swords comes in and starts drama. Um, and they get so much drama going on around this person. It's like they're just lost in it. They need to, they need to release whoever the fuck that is. And maybe they didn't have the confidence to do it before. Okay. But I'm seeing this. You deserve love and heart-to-heart -heart conversation. He said, I'm going to unload my heart. Because these feelings are real and worth exploring. Like, I can't continue to just sit here and hope that I run into this person one day. Like, I got to go try to find you. I got to go try to find this person. Just being near you is intoxicating. Of course it is. Divine feminine, divine masculine. Okay? This person said they're grateful for the spiritual lessons. Now, for some of you, yeah, that's why. You're the one. But some of you, the reason this person couldn't let you get close to them is because they got a, a crazy ass ex that they try to keep happy because this person is the type they will fucking, they're vindictive. They'll motherfucking call you, drive and get you fired. Like, this Queen of Swords is ruthless. And I, yep, I told you they need to release this person. They spend so much time trying to please this energy. And that's, I'm telling you, I couldn't let you get close to him. This Queen of Swords done fucked up a lot of shit, but somebody is coming. They're releasing it, this damn ex here. Some of them wasn't with this person. They were just still allowing this person to control their life some kind of way. Maybe they got kids. And the Queen of Swords is always saying how somebody's not good enough to be around their kids. Um, But somebody's just tired of being lonely, bro. And you know, Hell, these people could have been broke up for 10 years or seven years. I don't know. And it never really mattered what this, if the Quinn says she didn't like, if the Quinn of Swords says she didn't like the new girlfriend, okay, cool. It matters now because this is my divine feminine. This is my true love. This is the one. So <laughs> it says, go ahead and make the romantic gesture. Somebody's coming to express their love. But some of you, this is when this person's going to, like some type, some type of towel might hit their ass. Because I said somebody's looking for, they're going to last on the dresses with the moon here. They don't know where you at. Or they have they don't know how to get in contact with you. Okay, they want to reconcile here. They could be uh, thinking that you, somebody wants to take you on some type of trip with the honeymoon right here. Enjoy the bliss of holiday time together. So it's either around spring break or around the summer. Somebody, this person going to find your ass. Forgiveness out here twice. And they're going to want to take you. I'm here. <laughs> We're going on a trip in our favorite rocket ship. Mm -mm -mm -mm. That song came out in another reading with a king of wands. <coughs> Okay, so I don't know. But uh, somebody's like finally standing up. It's been, yeah, it's been a while since I knew it. I said, this ain't nobody you broke over with yesterday. This probably been a few years for somebody here. <laughs> they didn't see it. You, <sighs> they didn't see it. So, because I'm asking spirit in my mind, it's like if they're watching 
the divine feminine, if they're watching the Sagittarius, how is it that they don't know where the Sag is? Are they going to, that could be what makes them reach out. Let's keep going and figure it out. All right, so you got Ace of Cups. You got the Five of Wands. Yeah, somebody knew they had a crazy ass baby mama. Okay, a crazy ass. I don't know what the fuck. That Queen of Swords is no joke. And they've been controlling this person's life. And they've been allowing that shit. All right, so let's see. Uh, Spirit, how is this person going to find the Sagittarius? Please and thank you, Spirit. The star told you that to fucking tower. That's the tower. Somebody comes looking like last known address or calling the last known number and they're going to get a tower. Then you go to the moon. It's like they're driving around in the chariot. Okay. Now, what it, damn how that shit go. I should have never let her get away. Today is not a happy day. So many words that I had to say. Baby, I miss you and I need. See, and in that song, he went to the last place, knocked on the door, and new people lived in that house. So it wasn't the person that they was looking for. Somebody else lived there. Somebody's going to get a tower moment, and then they're going to go into this moon energy like, like, I don't know where this person is. I got to find this person. Okay, so now you got the seven of wands with the eight of wands. So some type of communication is going to come through that's going to reveal where you at. How are they going to do this? Because they don't, I'm telling you, they do not know. That's going to be the towel for that ass. Okay, I see the world here. The cycle of the two of you being in separation, that's about to end. I'm so for real. Somebody is so fucking determined. They determine the Sag, or you're determining whoever is who, okay? All right, so how they going to figure it out? Let me see, got the world. Pop that again. Some of y'all could, there could be distance, like a lot of distance with the world card here. Some of you guys could be dealing with a Taurus, uh, an Aquarius, a Scorpio, a Leo, Okay. There's that King of Pentacles again. So this could be someone who has it all, but they ain't got love. Because he said, I, I, I hid behind the material. All right, what else, Spirit? Look at that shit, bro. Nine of Swords, Nine of Cups. It's like, how could I not see it? It was in my face, complete wish fulfillment. I was too focused on money or trying to please this Queen of Swords. They could have breadcrumbed you, been just giving you a little bit because they're spending the majority of their time trying to please the Queen of Swords, who they might have a family with. Or whoever this Queen of Swords is. It's somebody that has some type of control over them, some kind of way. The card says it's an ex. Okay, but with the judgment here, this person wants a second chance. Okay, some of you guys are dealing with a Virgo here. Or some of you guys are dealing with a Capricorn. They could have been ghosting this toxic-ass energy. Like, I'm, I'm tired, I'm done. They just cannot believe they let you get away. And Spirit says, that's the damn truth. It's like, it was right there. I had this person in my hands. How the fuck did I let it go? Some of you guys may not even love this person anymore. I saw the Queen of Cups in the reverse. Told you, they ass is going to be looking. Mm. This is this is giving me going to the old hangouts. Maybe you guys used to hang out at a certain place or meet up at a certain place. They're going to go where people know you and they're going to be asking folk. That's exactly what they're doing. Hey, man, you seen the Sagittarius? What the hell is the Page of Swords? It's a watching and gathering of information. Okay. They're going to be going to, like I said, last known places. That's when they're going to get that towel. Somebody don't let us or something like that, okay? And then they're going to be going to people, asking people, have they seen you? This person going to watch, <laughs> baby, with that motherfucking magician in the three of wands. 
Somebody determined to find out where the hell you at. I'm hearing leads. Somebody following the leads, following up on the leads. Spirit say, that's the damn truth. I'm telling you, whoever the fuck this is is so fucking determined for Ace of Wands. A brand new beginning. Now, there's what I was looking for. The Seven of Swords. Because for some of you, I was asking Spirit in my mind, how is it that this person is watching? So for some of y'all, you're going to be talking to this person on your social media. Because they how they watching your ass. Because they don't physically know where you at. And they don't physically know how to get in contact with you as far as calling your phone. So this Seven of Swords is... It's like a catfish energy. You might be thinking you're talking to like, um, say for instance, you're on Facebook, Instagram, or whatever. This person about to get tricky. They're the fucking magician, okay? They are going to find out what it is that they need to find out. Even that hermit right there, they looking. They looking. So, if you want, um, <coughs> and like this right here, somebody could have got over a cold. If you're on social media, this person's going to screenshot a photo of somebody that you already friends with. Okay. I'm just telling you right there, like that, right there. Because they going to find they motherfucker. They going to get justice. That's just period. They going to get motherfucking justice because they want this connection. They want to, they finna put in the work on your ass. Now, for some of you, they could be watching you work. So, say for instance, you do what I do online. You got subscribers. You're talking to your emperor already. They leaving little comments and stuff. And you know, listen for questions of where you at? Like, um, especially if you do what I do. Listen for the questions like this. Oh, I'm in such and such. Where you live? We should do a meet and greet. Something like that, y'all. Listen for shit like that. But this person trying to get the roundabout way because it could be a lot of distance with the world and the moon. I don't know, they don't know what is what, okay? Or listen out for some of y'all really might be online because I'm hearing somebody's begging for a personal reading. Like, I really, I really need, they want, if you a reader, oh, hell no. I'm glad I don't do personal, baby. If you a reader, this damn ever finna get a personal reading from your ass. Hello? I'm so fucking for real. But that's not for everybody, because, okay, not everybody gonna resonate with that. But somebody is watching you work. They admire you. They watching your ass, and they trying to take action. They trying to figure out where you at. Okay, and so if they can't find it by going back to the old hangouts or going back to people that you know or people that you grew up with, that can also be that uh, Six of Swords. Excuse, I mean, Six of, uh, damn, Six of Swords. Spirit's guiding this person. The Six of Swords is your spirit guys guiding you. Because somebody's too damn determined. They're going to find it. Listen to me. This person going to find out what in the fuck they need. I mean, I was hearing. They following all leads. Last thing I know, she was living over there at such and such. Last I heard, she had done did this and did that. She was working over there at the Bird King. This person going to follow all fucking leads until they get ahead. Because I'm going to tell you what they would really want to do is show up. This is somebody who would like to show up. And when they can't, that's when they're going to resort to the Seven of Swords. Hello? That's when they're going to resort to the Seven of Swords. Will of Fortune in the reverse. Two of Wands with the Ace of Pentacles. That's what I'm getting. It's like this person not been having no luck finding what it is that they need to find with this Two of Swords. And they have to be careful with what they do because this person's still watching. But see, somebody watching this one too. This person watching, but there's a like a spirit guide watching over this energy. Because like I said, I was trying to say six of cups and I said six of swords. First of all, your twin, it's it's an energy. You're going to guide your person right to you some type of way. I don't know how the hell. For those of you where this is a twin flame, you're going to guide this person to you some type of way. All right, so now you got the damn. I told you they got everything, but they ain't got you. Ten of pentacles with the king of pentacles. This could have just been somebody who was focusing on their work and trying to appease their damn 
baby mama by staying single. Because I just saw the nine of pentacles. But somebody's tired of that shit. What the cards say you deserve love? They want real love. And they had it in their face. They had the one. Oh, y'all can't see that. They had the one in their face and couldn't see it because they're so busy dealing with this. This is a drama queen. Okay? It's just period. Somebody also feels like, now this may be for like three or four of you. They can't even go on without you. They feel like you was their good luck charm. Okay, so you got the high priestess with the hangman in the reverse. Some of you guys are a reader. Okay? So like I said, listen out for questions like that. A motherfucker begging you for a reading. Not begging, but like, I really have a personal issue and I just really, nobody else can do it but you. Shit like that. Because it's a million beautiful ass readers online. This person going to act like you the only motherfucker that, because you really could be enlightened. You feel me? High priestess with the hangman in the reverse. Can't nobody else do it but you. I don't want nobody else to do my reading but you. Only you and it's an emergency reading and I'll pay whatever. That's what this emperor saying. I'll pay whatever to get this person a reading. You need to know it's this person. And I feel like for those of you who give this person a reading because you don't know who in the fuck it is. But here's the thing. If you are enlightened, when you get to doing that reading, you're going to be doing that person's reading. You're going to be like, damn, this resonates with my situation. You're going to know. Hello? You're going to know it's them. If you truly tap the fuck in, like the experience said, that's a yes. If you truly tap in, like it's looking right here with the high priestess and the hangman in reverse, when they reach out to you, talking about they need this reading real bad. And if you do it, also, you might just start getting payments out of nowhere. Like, if you got Cash App or PayPal, this person, if they're not, of course, they're not going to use their name. But they're just going to start sending you money. Hmm. But you're going to know it's them. All right, what else, Spirit? Page of Wands. With the two of cups. <laughs> With the eight of one. Hell no. So the page of ones is good news. We already see this person is, what they say, they're going to come and unload their heart and hope that you'll forgive them and come back to them. So you're going to get a message online. So for the rest of y'all who are not readers and you just on Instagram or whatever the fuck it is, because I don't know. Okay, people be on every damn thing nowadays. This message is going to come online about what they want to do. Wow. Mm-hmm. It's King of Wands. Taking action to his Queen of Wands because that's his damn empress and he is in love. Hey, baby, I'm so for real. Aw, take him, but... Okay, so you got the Nine of Pentacles again. That go that down. Queen of Swords, they said. Trying to keep a motherfucker stuck. Girl, if you don't sit your boo-boo the fool looking ass down. Okay, sit your ass down. Damn. I don't know who the fuck this is. This Queen of Swords can have red hair. Or burnt orange or something. I don't know what the fuck that is. Okay. Something wrong with this person. Uh, maybe they limp or maybe they got hurt or something. Recently. I'm getting this person got a limp. Something wrong with their leg. They right knee. It looks swollen. That's a whole nother story. We're not going to get into it. But this person's about to get pissed off. Three of swords. Because they've hurt themselves some type of way. Trying to do something. And they're pissed because they feel like this person's supposed to be doing it. This could really be a baby mama who caused their baby daddy to do every fucking thing for them. But they're releasing. This baby daddy is not always. They're not at this person's every back and call now. This person projects on everything. They blame everybody. So when they finally hurt themselves, it's your fucking fault. If you would have been here changing the whatever the fuck, I would have never failed. What? I don't know who the fuck that Queen of Swords is. It's an old bitter motherfucker who try to make life hard for people. That's who it is. Like I said, girl, you need to sit your 
boo boo the fool looking ass the fuck down. Could be an old air sign. Ain't nobody but motherfucker who cold hearted and codependent and clingy as fuck. Like y'all ain't like the, they ain't together. King of Swords with the Queen of Swords with the King of Pentacles. They not together, but she expect him to be at her every back and call. Girl, you don't lost your motherfucking mind. You don't even stand up. <laughs> you don't even stand up to the Empress. And then all you do is bitch and complain. Well, I wouldn't have failed if you did. The girl sit your ass down. Shit. Uh, Fucking corn it could be a Capricorn for some of y'all. This motherfucker done pissing me out. Like she's trying to keep y'all apart. <clears throat> God, it hurt. The bitch been hurt for years. This is a a, a cold hearted motherfucker. Queen of Cups in the reverse with the Queen of Swords. This bitch is treacherous too. Misery love company. And maybe they used to link up and talk about how men and women ain't shit. They might, I saw that not the ones. They could have been having sex with this person still. You know, hit it every now and again. But it's like the Queen of Swords wants this King of Pentacles to settle for that shit. What did the card say? You deserve love. You lovable. Why the fuck would you settle for an old dust ass piece of pussy and a motherfucker who talks shit all the time when you can have a motherfucking divine feminine? This bitch done lost her damn mind. The fuck? What's this, spirit? Yeah, she view you as competition, boo-boo. Five of ones with the strength. She trying to have power. She want to have control over this person. She feel like if he get with you, then she going to lose her power. I don't know why the fuck you think you supposed to have power. You ain't got control over nobody but your damn self. This person could be in a wheelchair, too, for somebody. Or they going to be in a wheelchair after they had this file right here. Okay, so anyway, this person's walking away from that over control, and I already said that they're releasing that person, but that person holding on. Mm. I said that in my life. Somebody asked me, "What do you do when you don't tell somebody's over and they won't let go?" That ain't none of your motherfucking business. You already told them what it is. Go on over there and get what the fuck it is you know you want to get. That ain't your problem that this person can't let go. They fucking clingy, clingy cups in the reverse, and then they be bitching all the time. And all they, all they gonna give you is a piece of pussy. It's probably dried out. Just like that air up there. Shit probably dry as fuck. Nobody got time for that shit. Wanna control something so damn bad. If it were gonna work, it would've worked. The shit been dead and over with. Leave that shit the fuck out in the cold. Period. Some of y'all can have a, a Scorpio watching. Or a Libra. Or a Cancer. A Pisces. That's stuck on stupid. I don't know, child. I don't even want to get into that person like that. Yeah, they're trying to see how they can sabotage something. Oh, Lord, spirit. Okay, you got the fool. What's been to happen? Let me see this month. Yeah. Ten of Pentacles. They following the money. This person is a, a King of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles. Okay? This Queen of Swords following the money. That's all she wants is the money. She could be watching somebody work, too. I don't know what the fuck going on with this person. All right, so Spirit, what's going to be? I see the Eight of Cups again. I was going to say, Spirit, what's going to be the outcome? King of Cups. Somebody's not dealing. Yes. They walking away from this bullshit, and they're going to find the information however the fuck they need to find it. Because they in love. King of Cups, King of Cups. It's just period. So, y'all don't even need to worry about the little Queen of Swords. Bitch can't walk no damn way. Big swole ass kneecap. She can't even walk. Okay? I don't know what the fuck that happened to her ass. That what she get for being so damn mean. She could have tripped and fell over some air. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm so for real. This motherfucker could have tripped and fell over some air. Like something in the audience just pushed her ass. Like, girl, sit your ass out. <laughs> She's so mean. Y'all, this is somebody who is... Look, Queen of Cups in reverse with the Queen of Swords, y'all. This motherfucker here is mean as fuck. <laughs> she looked behind her with nobody there but her head. Her whole damn face in the concrete. Somebody push the fuck out of her head. Hell nah, spirit. What's going on? Okay. Because, baby, we ain't got this shit to do. Four of swords. There's that six of swords. Yep. Some guy in that king of wands. That king of cups, king of wands. What we see right here. King of cups, king of wands. Like... 
Like what I'm saying, you don't even worry about this right here. You about to get this message, okay? Because this person going to work with whoever the fuck they got to work with to find out what it is they need to find out. Now, it just appeared. I keep seeing this Eight of Cups. What in the fuck is this Eight of Cups keep popping up here for? This person just, they like really cannot believe what they did. <laughs> they feel like this Queen of Swords fucks everything up for them and they always do. But you know, at some point you gotta be accountable. It's like people can only do what you allow. Yeah, this is an ex-spouse. King of Swords, Queen of Swords. Yeah, it's an ex-spouse. Who's trying to control his money. But she's still hurting. Like, this shit is changing. She don't. She want to keep this person single. But with the Wheel of Fortune here, things is changing. First, the Wheel of Fortune was in the reverse. Now it's in the upright. But like I said at the beginning, the only person that can give life back into this energy because they have everything that they could want in the material because that's what they hid behind. Um, they hid behind the material and settled for a little piece of ass on Sunday and to be at this person's every back and call. They now they want real love. It's just the truth of it. It don't matter what the fuck going on. And like I said, they're going to find you. I'm going to find you wherever. Wherever you may have went, they're going to find your ass. And they're going to unload their heart Eight of Wands, and hope that you'll take them back. Okay? This ain't, I don't say Terry's reading, but damn it, it's somebody's. And they want to heal this with the star card. They want to heal this connection. The Eight of Cups again. Like, oh, I was going to say, why do I keep seeing it? They regret walking away from the Sag. But they, they couldn't let you get close to them because of their damn jealous ass Queen of Swords. Okay, but the real love, because see, now the Queen of Cups in the upright. The real love is with this Divine Feminine. The reason we keep seeing this Eight of Cups is because somebody regrets walking away from the Sagittarius, who's an Earth Angel, who is also the Empress Queen of Cups. Okay, and they feel like this old jealous motherfucker did this bullshit to keep them single because they greedy. Okay, but somebody know that this over here is complete wish fulfillment. So I, it's kind of like I hear this person saying, Okay, I'm going to just give your ass, I don't know, three, four hundred dollars a month, child support. That's it. Don't call me unless it's about the kids. Something like that. Somebody had to stand up for themselves. Because that was really dealing with some over-controlling motherfucker. He really, that, this person feels entitled too. Yeah, with the world. Like, that shit is over with. This person by self, hermit, hermit. And I'm telling you, they going... Damn, I hope y'all can still see. I didn't even see my camera was off. They in Hermit, and they going back to folks, asking people, have y'all seen the Sagittarius? Tell me, have you seen her? Oh, my God. Have you seen her? Yes, baby. Tell me, have you seen her? Seen her? Now, for some of you, because I was getting that broken screen on that moon card, this Queen of Swords in the reverse could have did that shit. Yeah, I was getting a cracked screen and the phone was blacked out. She could have did that. Okay, somebody's just so fucking jealous and over controlling and I don't know, because they're not together. So what the fuck is the problem? I don't know, child. It's like they don't want they don't want the emperor, but they don't want the emperor to be with nobody else. Oh no, nah, baby, that's not gonna work. Okay? You need to go sit your ass down somewhere and fucking heal. Since you think you're supposed to be controlling everybody's life with your big kneecapped ass. I don't know what happened. Her ass fell somewhere. If she hadn't, she will. Spirit showed it to me. <laughs> and she might even have to end up in a chair, a wheelchair. She might have to wear a casket for a while. Damn, did I say a casket? What? The fuck? It's not what I was trying to say. I was trying to say a cast. But y'all know we channeling, okay? So what come through, come through. Uh, what come through, come through. But anyway, she might have to wear a cast for a while on that leg. Her spirit showed it to me loud and clear. Her ass gonna fall. And let me tell you, it's gonna really seem like somebody pushed her. But ain't gonna be nobody there. It's gonna fall the shit that she been putting out. 
Like this is somebody who is treacherous, okay? Period. And then they're trying to come in between divine union. No, nah, baby, that's a that's a big ass no no. And it's gonna be a whole bunch of motherfuckers this year realizing. Don't fuck with the divine, the di divine plan of things, the divine order of things. Do not fuck with the divine. Cause what the divine is unfuckwittable. Fuck with me, you don't wish you had never did that now. And it's just period. So let me get y'all some messages on the way out the door. Let me turn these up now. Self-worth. What's behind that? Vibrations. Yes. Reinvention. This person is reinventing themselves too. By releasing this dried up ass corny. Cause they starting to understand the connection that you the one. And they sitting over here playing with somebody who be trying to make their life hard. Like this person does unnecessary shit. Okay, reconciliation, trust. Yeah, they codependent. I knew it. That Queen of Cups in reverse. Codependent as fuck. And so she finna be mad because she ain't finna be crippled in the wheelchair. And he ain't gonna be nowhere to be found. Okay, there's the death card. Something might really happen to this person. You know, it depends on what this person playing with. It's gonna be different for all of y'all. But with the death and the five of wands, she could, somebody could have a freak accident. It's, a, it's like, okay, wow. Someone could become bedridden and then pneumonia could set up in their chest. Double pneumonia could set up in someone's chest. Walking pneumonia, just like that shadow one right there. Walking pneumonia. Walking pneumonia. That's double pneumonia, ain't it? I think it's double pneumonia. Somebody could pass away like that. I'm telling you, it could be a sudden death. But it's karmic in nature because of all of the shit that this person has been putting out into the universe. This is all they put out. What did I say when I, I looked at that queen of swords? I said, that's a drama queen. That's all they do is cause drama. So that will of fortune in reverse is something's karmic in nature. Somebody's about to receive bad karma. It's like the one thing that was keeping this person from receiving their karma is the emperor. When they walked away, that will of fortune in the reverse. Something's suddenly going to happen. They could fall and hurt themselves, okay? And then they could become bedridden. Who? This greedy ass spouse. Sudden wealth of spouse. This is somebody who greedy as fuck. I mean, privileged lady. That's that queen of swords. So, like I said, this could be an ex spouse. Um, and it's like they could be become bedridden. It's like once they ha that fall happens, it's a, a domino effect. And it's all karmic in nature. Period. Like 10 breaking down to a 10. That's it. Tower with the deck. It's going to be sudden. This is going to be some like, wow. Somebody could be in their 30s. This is going to be some sudden shit, bro. The cause of death would look like a fucking fall, but it's not, it's not a fall. It's like Something's going to happen where this person get in they, they bedridden or in a wheelchair or something. And then double pneumonia going to set up in them lungs or some shit. Like, I don't know what the hell this is. Okay? But like I said, it's because of all of the drama. Five of Wands, Five of Pentacles that they have been causing on folk. And they do this to a lot of people. And the Emperor was the only one dumb enough to keep putting up with this person's shit. And I feel like it's because they got a family. So maybe they felt like they didn't have no choice because that's the type of person that'll tell you, oh, well, you can't see little JoJo or I'm take your ass child support court or I'm going to call your job and get you fired or this is the type of energy that'll spread rumors online. Vindictive. This person's very vindictive, okay? Wow. Damn, Sage. That's y'all reading. Let me get y'all some of these messages here. Y'all had a long ass reading. Be willing to forgive because somebody coming towards you and they're getting trustworthy guidance to do so. That's their six of swords. I just saw goddess. Okay, spirit, what's the message for the Sagittarius Collective? Parents, okay? So for some of you, that could be their parents. For others of you, it's their baby mama, baby daddy. Medium. Remember I said somebody here could be a... <laughs> I can't never make it up, child. We saw high priestess with the hangman in the reverse. You could be a medium. You could have the natural ability to connect to the departed loved ones, okay? Archangel Michael is here to help this person cleanse and detoxify from that karmic. Your person is an, is an empath. 
What did I say? The only thing that was keeping that Queen of Swords from getting their karma is the Emperor. Once that Emperor Eight of Cups is situation, it's like a domino effect. Okay? Relationships. And focus on service. So, for some of you guys, if you're a medium, Spirit wants you to continue to focus on service here. Okay? Profoundly clairvoyant. What else, Spirit? Crystals, you're protected. Just period. I already said that. Okay? I said the divine is unfuckwittable. You're protected with these crystals right here. What else, Spirit? Be willing to forgive because somebody's coming to ask for forgiveness. Who? At the bottom of the deck. That's it. And the Ascended Masters is helping to guide this person. They're hoping that you will only see love. Because this person been through enough, all right? Look past the seeming errors, mistakes, and misunderstandings. And see only love within each person, including yourself. Spirit's going to resolve this, but they want you to be open to forgiveness. You need to know that somebody really had old crazy-ass ex controlling shit. And in order for Archangel Michael to be here, Archangel Michael is the, the angel of protection. And with this cleansing detoxify, that Queen of Swords could have also been playing in magic. And that could be the reason for the tower and the death. Because I was trying to say cask, and I said coffin or casket, something like that. So something suddenly is going to happen here to a, a privileged lady, an ex-spouse, okay? Okay, this is maybe for one or two people's child. <laughs> Somebody was trying to do something to your work, like stop your money or something. Something's coming back on this person that's what's going to cause that sudden death. But here's the thing, y'all. That damn emperor, they might become a single parent. There's some insurance on this um, Queen of Swords. Because this is what I, when, when I've seen this card, that's what I got. Like somebody's going to get the insurance off this person dead. Y'all. What the fuck? Like literally, there's an insurance policy on a karmic. And what did I say? It's, it's going to look like an accident. See, spirit is over this. Okay, spirit is over this. They could just have accidental insurance or whatever. Okay? This emperor gonna get the money off of it. Okay, they might have to fight some other family members for it, but they're gonna get it. It might be some grandparents or something like that that they have to fight. Because the five of ones, it's, it's like family arguing and fighting over money. Okay, that's, like I said, it's not for everybody. That's for somebody here. All right. Okay, that's what I have for the Sagittarius Collective. I love y'all from the bottom of my feet. Only take what resonates, leave the rest. All right. Mm, mm, mm. Be willing to forgive now. Till next time. Bye.